Hello everyone, this is Paradox, back to another video. Today I'll be doing 10 Rue example solves in 10 minutes, so let's get into it. First one. Oops, alright, so there's this, uh, there's this, this, um, it's also this. Nothing looks too great. But I do see something. So I'm looking at these two. And I see I can do a U prime and then get that. So I just do that. E to insert so that this stays. And then you just have this case. Okay. Then there's this. Enter DR. Then I have this case, these two, and then this CMLR. Then here, I don't know if this is a NeoLR, but the way I do it is that to get side bottom. Alright, next one. Okay. So here I see this DL. And there's also that DL, green yellow. So I would do this. So I see these two can pair up like that. So, and I also see these two are like that. So what I would do is start to like pair these two up, but put in sneak an M2 in between. And then I insert this, and then this. Uh, oh yeah, like that. And then dr. So this case, I see something nice. That for a second. Oh, that did the whole block. It didn't even. That was intentional, but that's nice. That CML. And then this case is just fast look ahead for me. And then that for C. Okay, third one. Okay, I see something nice here. Um, when I see these three, I look for non-matching or just mismatched uh, centers. And this is actually really nice as a two-move block. All I need to do is U, B2 to put this into here. And then I know my DR is going to be here, so I could just do U, R2 after. So let's do that. And then... I see this case followed by this sledge and I won't do an R wide because this will have to be up here anyways so that similar I knew it would preserve so I know to me that do you two and then that case okay number four. So I see this, this, pretty okay deal options. So this bar, I don't like that though. Hmm, okay. I'm gonna do this, so M prime, and then I just paired up like this, and then just U2 for these two. And then here I could immediately see how to do this sec uh, this first square because I knew when I insert TR I would make this case and then here I could actually pair these two by doing a wide inserting all right so same seal as last time so I know I'm gonna have to do a U prime after because it preserves U prime and then this uh, ULR so we're into sensors all right Okay, this one looks nice. I see this, 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 some other stuff. Hmm. It's a lot of stuff, but none of it connects too well. But I do see something. So I'm going to do this. 
orange yellow so I'd hold it on the left and then utilize this pair and then I knew these two would end up like this okay so dr I would do that way because I knew I'd get this case this case and then I have this CML okay nice EOLR good arrow side back and then I know it's gonna be this columns case okay This one, I see this. Okay, that looks pretty good because this is just right here to connect up to here. And yeah, I would do that, but I'm gonna do an E to insert this into here because if I didn't, I'd have to do a U2 for these two, but if I do an E, then it's just U prime. So that, insert, uh, DR, actually, before I do that, I can just insert this pair like that. Then this case, CML, and then here I have this EOLR for side bottom, and then dots to just cancel into like that. Okay, this one, I see some mediocre things, but nothing great. Yeah, okay. So, I'm gonna do this, because I saw I could do this, and then that leads up to this. Not the most efficient, but it's all right. So then DR is back here. And now, I would just do R word too. And then we have this case, uh, this case, and then the CML, and then this is kind of a bad LSC, but there, and then that 4C. Alright, I think at the beginning I was falling behind on time, but now I'm catching up. A few more to do. Alright, so here I have this DL. Okay, so it's actually good for CFOP. Lots of white DLs. Um, okay, I see something pretty nice. So I'm going to do this green DL because I see I can solve these two like this. And then this is a pretty nice case. Just like that. And then here I would solve these two. And I know this is blue. So I would do this. And so like that. CML. It's a new ALG I learned, it's better than the old one I used to do. And then this, pretty bad LSC. Um, yeah, this case. Okay. Oh, this is pretty good. Um, these two, it's the most obvious thing. So we'll do it, because that's the best thing I see. So I would just do this, D prime, M, and then I would do an M2, because it makes this easier to track. So I know it's here, so just do that to insert. And then here, I would just do this three mover, followed by this, this CML. And then this case, I usually just do it like that, then you get this. Could do misoriented centers, but I suck at it. Okay. Last one. So here, there's this and this. I'm just gonna go for it, because it looks promising. But the execution's a little wacky, just watch. So do U prime R. And you'll see why in a second. I'll do U wide and then E prime. So that we get this case, which is pretty good. And then this, just 
increased DR. I'm doing wide moves to see more things. I see this. And then this case. And then there's this. Okay, this EULR, pretty nice. And we have this cancellation. All right, so that was just about in 10 minutes, a little bit under. So yeah, thanks for watching.